I'm Eleanor Dubinsky and I'm a songwriter and I have been working with Field of Music for several years now, uh, primarily at New York Presbyterian Hospital. And I work with pediatric oncology patients. And my name is Mary Lee Cordes and I've also been working with Field of Music for a very long time. Uh, I've done a variety of programs with them. I'm a songwriter and singer and performer and a guitar player, so I teach songwriting. Uh, and write songs with the various kids that we've worked with throughout the various programs. And most recently, I've been so happy to be up at Columbia Presbyterian um, on the seventh floor, the Children's Oncology Unit, working up there with kids, writing songs with them or for them or with their siblings or for their siblings. And it's been a great joy. What happens for me on a typical day, I get there and I strap on my guitar and immediately if there's a kid around, and I'll, I start to roam the floor, I look for my people to work with who, who seems open and who uh, seems to want music. And invariably, there's staff that go, thank you. There are parents that go, please will you come and play, play for my son, play with my daughter. And they're so grateful to have this element added to what's a, a fairly traumatic experience that they're all going through. You know, you build trust and relationships with staff, with patients, and that is what I think enables the patients to open up more. And it's a very, very vulnerable situation mm -hmm. uh, that the families and the patients are in. And to be able to be that kind of a support and that kind of vehicle for self-expression, um, I think it does require trust. Um, and that is also a big part of what we need to do. We have to be containers or just available for a child or a family to be able to say what's going on with them. Uh, and I think the, the consistency of being able to see the same patient again and again mm -hmm. does help to build that relationship so that they have more of a chance to, to sing.